How to remove Microsoft Edge browser? This question may arise because this browser is built into the system by default and you may not use it. Another point, processes and services related to Microsoft Edge start automatically and consume some extra resources. Let's figure out how to disable or completely remove Edge. But I want to note that if you need Copilot, do not delete Edge. Subscribe to the PCNP channel and also support the video with comments and likes. First, how to disable Edge Auto Start. This is the easiest way to free up computer resources from unnecessary processes. Open the Edge browser, click on the three dots in the top right corner, then Settings. On the left select the System and Performance section. Here disable the Startup Boost, then Edge won't automatically start in the background when the PC is turned on. Also disable the second toggle switch, background work to close the process after closing the browser. In addition to this step, you can disable Edge Update Services. Go to the Registry Editor. Remember that all actions in this editor are at your own risk, it's better to create a backup or restore point just in case. Go to the HK Local Machine, System, Current Control Set, Services section. Here we need to disable the startup of Edge Update Services and Edge Update M service. Change the parameter start to 4 and after restarting the system these two services will not run in the background. If you still decide to completely remove the Edge browser, use the following methods. And warning, before this check if you have another browser on your PC because without it you can't open internet and install any browser. To easily and automatically remove the Edge browser from your computer, you can use our tool – PC No Problems Assistant. Go to the Service section, Popular tab, click Remove Edge and wait a bit while the program performs the necessary actions. At the end of the process it will show that the browser has been removed. This program is developed personally by me. This function is free, but you will find many useful functions for your Windows here. I developed this app for two years already, try it and if you want to support it, buy a pro version. Now I will show you the code of the program, how it deletes the Edge browser and here is the algorithm how to delete Edge from PC manually. To do this, I install the browser again on the computer and remove it without program. At the beginning of removing the Edge browser, stop the process associated with it. For this, open the command prompt in run, type cmd and run it as administrator. Enter the command task kill im msh.exe and press enter. Now delete the program files located on drive C, program files x86, Microsoft. Here delete three folders, Edge, Edge Core and Edge Update. The Edge Web View folder is another program, it may be needed for other programs to view the internet content. Do not delete it. Now go to drive C, program data, Microsoft and delete the Edge Update folder. You can delete also user data in the C users, your username, app data, local Microsoft folder. And here's the H folder. Essentially, the browser is removed now. If we find its shortcut in the start menu, it no longer works and can also be removed. But you need to take a few more actions so that the browser doesn't restore itself. Open the registry editor, go to the HK Local Machine, Software, Microsoft section, create a key with the name Edge Update and inside it create a dword 32-bit parameter with this name and assign it a value of 1. This is protection against updating and restoring. Now in the same registry editor find the path HK Local Machine, System, Current Control Set, Services. Here are the settings for various services. Disable the startup of Edge Update Services and Edge Update M Services. Change the parameter to 4 and after restarting these two services will not run in the background. And one more change in the registry to remove the browser from the list of programs. Open the key at this address and delete the Edge and Edge Update keys. Now the browser will not appear in the system applications and that's all. You can restart if necessary and check the result. 
Write in the comments if you use this browser and if you want to reinstall Edge after deleting you can use PCNP Assistant to find official site. Links in description.